Welcome to Fucking Tech and another keyboard review. <laughs> uh, we're not going to make anything crazy or funny voices or anything, but it's a very short um, uh, review, I guess, uh, intro. Uh, nothing crazy here. Uh, this is uh, the Redragon uh, Devajaris K5, uh, K556 RGB-KR. The KR stands for... Uh, keys round or RK? No, it's out RK. Yeah, K556 RGB dash RK. So that's for the round keys here. There we go. Now I got my uh, ripple activated because the Red Red Dragon keyboards have the the nicest uh, ripples. They're, they're very nice. Just checking. The, yeah, RGB RK. So round keys. There's two versions of this. One version with the, the square keys. And a version with the fugly round keys, like uh, old style typewriter type of thing there. Oh my god, that's ugly. And it types weird too. Doesn't type great. It's 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 not good. Um, it's not it's not fantastic. So this is fresh out of the box. I already know how this works because the I have the K589 Shrapnel. It works the same, but this is not a low-profile keyboard keyboard like the K589 Shrapnel. So this is a standard key size, standard height keys. So uh, I got this not because it's ugly. It's because I'm going to change everything. <laughs> this is for another project. I'm going to build a keyboard for someone. So I'm going to rip all these keycaps out. Rip out all the keyboards, mostly most keys here and I uh, replace those for something else so uh, this is not a uh, uh, I'm not keeping this as it is so this is going for some uh, for going for someone else and it's gonna be totally transformed into something else. so uh, subscribe and look for the next video just to make sure that you catch that see what I do with this thing uh, so this keyboard is um, very uh, simple you got your default uh, wavy or breathy thing there and you got your function up down for your brightness might not see it there's four levels of brightness when you max out the brightness all these three all the three lights flash here in the indicators so uh, when you max out it's uh, so there's four levels so uh, it's not super bright um, anyways if I if I reduce the lighting here uh, you'll see it more but uh, it it uh, it affects the uh, camera focus, so it's not too great. So, so there's like for the insert home, page up, uh, Dell, page down. If you combine with it's a function, you got like three uh, different modes for each button here for the lighting. So you got uh, the other server like a wavy thing, or oh, I guess not. Oh, it's not moving. Anyways, so you can cycle through the colors with the function right. So very simple. All right, going back to that, then you can switch uh, if it moves around, if it waves around. You can switch directions with the function uh, D. So left or right, and you got the home button, which gives you like uh, it's like a ripple effect, and you got the key. If you're, it, it'll remember your keys here. That's a uh, find my password mode. You got another type of ripple effect here. So it cycles through that. So you got like a rainbow. Rainbow colors here. Ooh, okay, so this just all out rainbow all the time. <laughs> Get adjust the speed with the function uh, minus to slow down and equal to increase the speed. And when you reach maximum, obviously these indicators max out that they, they indicate that they're you're maxed out. So we got, what else here? We got another, all right, a little design motif there. Rain drops fall on the keyboard and uh, making you wonder if your keyboard's waterproof. All right, so we got the back, so now the, oh yeah, okay. This is the uh, insert is like straight colors. It doesn't move. If you go to Dell, function Dell, then you got the breathing, it's like a wave. Then you can uh, choose the direction, so it's a little wave to the left if you change direction. So uh, you got a couple of uh, wave. This is like a larger wave. 
So that's uh, what it does. Oh, we got like a circling there, I guess. Rotation. And we got the end, I think. Uh... Oh, this is like a permanent uh, rainbow. Oh, there we go. Another raindrop. Another type of wave. Oh, this is like from bottom to top or something. And then... Okay, so you can change direction. Uh, all right, static rainbow. Okay, then page down we got like a rainbow wave. All right, rainbow wave. What else we got? We got static color again. Is it breathing this? I don't know. Another type of rainbow wavy thing. So that's basically uh, the effects and. This is all in the keyboard. This is out of the box factory. This is fresh out of the box. <laughs> just, just, uh, um, and yeah, there's a software that comes with it. I have not installed it, but you can um, get the software at uh, Re Redragon Zone or something. Yeah, I think it's Devajadas. Devarajas? That's a confusing name. I don't know what that is. De Deva, De Deva Jadas or Deva Rajas? Deva Rajas. Okay, Deva Rajas. I'll say it seven times. Deva Rajas. Deva Rajas. Deva Rajas. And we have a sticker here. Uh, Red Dragon Zone. So it's not Red Dragon Zone. It's Re Dragon Zone. Anyways. So we got uh, a little leaflet. We got a little booklet with uh, 10,000 languages. And basically the manual is like uh, two pages. So uh, it indicates your, your function keys for your colors. And it comes with um, spare sets of keys. I've seen other videos where they got uh, Automo Blue switches that come with the keyboard, but I get the spare Automo Brown keyboard uh, key switches because uh, this keyboard uses brown switches. So I don't know what happened to the blues. Uh, so I got I got brown switches with this one. Now, one of the key features of this keyboard is that you can remove the keycaps, obviously, because it's an MX Cherry style uh, keycap set that you put on there. But also, the switches are removable. So that's why I'm going to use this keyboard for another project. So I didn't buy this keyboard for the keycaps. I didn't care about the keycaps because they're ugly. And I'm going to change them for something else much more classy. So uh, you got your uh, key switch puller in here. So you got your uh, key cap puller. I don't really use this. I use the wire ones. Uh, key switch puller. And like my other Redragon Shrapnel and my K uh, my Kali, uh, these switches are very hard to pull out. So uh, it's a little bit unfortunate because you can easily break your keys, your, your, your switches. So what I do is I really tightened, tightened the base, all right? And then separately, I pull with my other hand, with my fingers tightening the base. Oh, this one was pretty good. So what happens by squeezing the um, the, the switch puller? It squeezes here, and basically it it uh, breaks the housing on the side because the housing is very thin. So uh, it's basically to push on the the, the clip, but uh, for some reason they feel like they're I feel like they're stuck or uh, glued almost into the into the socket. So uh, not great, not great. But uh, it, you're you're gonna damage. Say I already damaged this one. I pulled it up before, and uh, the housing on on the side is already a little bit damaged. So not fantastic. So uh, if you want to keep your switches, uh, they're gonna they're still gonna work, but you might have some issues pulling them out again. So that's pretty much it for this uh, Devajaris, Devaj, Devaraj, <laughs> De, uh, Devarajas. Okay, Devarajas. So uh, fairly, uh, fairly basic keyboard. Uh, I got this uh, because the person I'm going to build a keyboard for enjoys RGB. So uh, that's the reason I got this. So uh, this is not a project where I'm going to get a ducky or some other cool keyboard because I'm replacing the switches to specifically put some silent 
key switches in those so follow my next video for that so this is uh all black uh no braided it's just standard rubber cable with this and you got your uh standard uh stand-up feet there to prop up the keyboard so standard stuff nothing crazy uh the base is uh, very sturdy um typing on these run keys is somewhat terrible uh, and um, the keys on this are actually it's like they're low profile keys but they're fitting on standard size switches um, so it's not fantastic if I pull out here I got my other key this is a razor keycap compare this to the other keycap the Devaratus and you see it's like it's quite higher and uh, it, 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 it flows around the key switch, which the, this one doesn't. Um, so this one doesn't surround the key cap or the, the key switch. So uh, it doesn't mitigate any sound. So um, not fantastic. So uh, anyways, these are not the reason I got this keyboard. So uh, I, actually, because this keyboard with the run keys, it was cheaper than the one with the square keys. So I guess this is all I need because these are being ripped out, ripped out anyway. So that's my other project so uh not important for this but uh, at least you get an, uh, an overview of what the uh devaragis <laughs> what do i keep forgetting this devaragis k556 rgb rk so you get a first look you get an idea of this thing what it looks like and uh what it is so brown keys have a little tactile bump so it doesn't smash down to the base uh, so you get a so, so with the tactile bump, you it gives you an idea of when you're you're actually triggering or more or less. So I have a, you have a feedback. So it's not just uh, smashing the keyboard and like the keys into uh, the, the the bottom. Yeah. So that's that, and uh, yeah, special uh, key. So obviously these are out of move sockets. So you can only put out of move switches in this keyboard if you want to change out the key switches. So uh, that's that for this keyboard, I guess. Uh, nothing crazy. Indicators on the top right. It's a nice metal. Uh, everything's metal. Metal top. Uh, I'm not sure. This is, seems like plastic, but the top is metal. It, it, you know, you feel, it feels pretty good. So uh, for RGB fans, uh, I, I think the lighting might be a little bit subdued. I don't know if it's the keys. I'll see what my other key set that I'm putting in for my other project, for my modification project. I don't have a name yet, so just follow the channel for the next video on this. So that's the Deva Rajas. Deva Rajas. Yeah, De Deva, Deva Rajas. Okay, there we go. I got it. Deva Rajas. So um, here we go. That's that. So nothing crazy here, just uh, RGB keyboard and uh, modifiable. So that's its uh, main feature that I'm, I'm going to use. All right, so this is Deva Rajas K556 RGB RK. Fuckingtech.com